games go, good games stay, a duck opinion quack plays. A duck's opinion. Now. What's up guys, the duck opinion here, and we're gonna play this game called Prison Architect or Archives. I think it's Archives. Yeah, well I'm gonna call it Prison Break, okay? So it's called, I think, Prison Archives, but I'm going to call it Prison Break. So when I say Prison Break, I'm talking about this game. So uh, this was first introduced by my buddy Juno from the Epic Media. And uh, I seen him play it, and he looked kind of interesting, but I didn't really take full notice into it. I mean, he kind of made it look not so fun, you know. Juno, you need to work on that. Make your games look more funner. No, but um, they have a cool tutorial in this game. I don't want to go over it because it's kind of... It's kind of long and I just want to jump into a game and record it, but, you know, I've seen this game from Juno, then I saw, I think, IGN play a little bit of it, and I just got really into it, so I'm going to play maybe for an hour or so, we're just going to build ourselves a prison, I'm going to tell you some stuff I know about it and how to maybe even get better at it. Now, um, I messed up a lot, you know, you gotta do a lot of trial and error when you're playing a crazy game like this. I made, like, different areas for everything when I first started. Like, I'd have, like, just one house over here for, like, showers, one house over here for cells, one house over here for an office. And now, that was the first game I ever played, and as soon as the guards showed up, as soon as the, uh, prisoners showed up, not the guards, but the prisoners, they all just ran away. They all just straight up ran away. So it was quite quite embarrassing. So now I make I make one huge foundation. And I also come over here and take the grants right away. F it. The grants are cool because you get a lot of money right off the bat and it pretty much tells you what you need to do. We need to build a holding cell, shower, yard, kitchen, uh, the cafeteria, at least two guards, at least two chefs like we're gonna do all this anyway that's normal stuff so it's the basics and then we're gonna do you know we're gonna hire some stuff we're gonna unlock some stuff I'm we're gonna get this far in it I'm, I'm, I'm gonna at least go that far so it's gonna be a good few episodes <clears throat> um last game I played I played for about two hours this game is very addicting you can get it on Steam it's I think it's like 15 bucks well we had the Steam sale going on this game was at I think ten dollars I think I might be wrong but it was at a pretty good price I like it so um what else do we have to do? Raise your prison capability to 15. We can easily do that. Um, build a medic ward, at least two doctors. So I did everything on this list before, and we're going to do it all again, and hopefully in a better sense. What happened with me is there was a riot in my last game in the showers, and I ended up spending too much money, and I got fines from the riot. So I had no money, and I pretty much just had to sit there and just wait for money to come in, and not enough was coming in to keep me playing. I wasn't making enough. And um, some of my characters, my prisoners, were like stuck. They were like stuck inside the wall. So it was kind of weird. So I mean, this game's still kind of in beta or whatever, alpha, whatever we call it. So it's going to have a lot of a lot of things wrong with it. <laughs> and that happened to be just one of them. So we're going to place the door there. And, uh, yeah, I like this game a lot, though, you know. If we really get into it, you know, I kind of want to make this... I could do some tips and tricks for this game. I mean, there's a lot of different ways you can do a lot of different stuff, like how to build holding cells, like how to start off, like how to actually make money, how to progress, how to prevent riots, and cool stuff like that, you know. But it depends how you guys get into it. I always just kind of try to keep in mind that Minecraft made its name when it was a little indie game, just like this. When it was just a little running around and building some blocks of nothing else. And then it became this huge, you know, this huge hit that's a fantastic game that everyone's played and also is the heart of this channel. And you never know what indie game could be next. Could be this one. So with this being put in, this door, it will overlap this and complete it with floors and it'll be done. There we have it. Now I can make these into areas, but before we need to do that, we need to put utilities. Everything is going to need a power source, and it is also going to need a water pump. So I'm going to make both and start extending cables into areas that we will need. And the same with the... 
Same with the pumps, but I might, I'm gonna wait, cause I don't know where I'm gonna put everything yet. But doing this right here, that'll give us power and that'll give us water and it'll all be linked up far enough to turn everything on and to have a water line in here to put wherever I'm gonna put things. Next thing I'm gonna do is start laying out things. We have concrete walls we're gonna build, so I'm gonna build them in here. Um, let's see, we're gonna need a holding cell. It's probably the first thing I wanna build because a holding cell is good. It's where we're gonna keep the bastards as soon as they come in. I'm going to put the holding cell right here, so as soon as they walk in, they go directly in the holding cell, and it's going to be a tiny holding cell, and behind the holding cell, back here, we're going to have cells. I'm going to try to make these cells as small as possible, try to boof out a door or two, like that. You can right, you can right click to kind of delete a path, and you got to remember doors are going to be placed, so you're going to put a door here while they're building. So I really know how to play this. I've played this game for at least five hours. It's a great game, or I wouldn't be covering it. Like, I love this game. It's really awesome. Even my lady was playing it. She was, she built a prison, so you can tell it's good if Harley tries it. So I want to in here make cells. These are a little hard, but you can only do them. I think it's two by three, something like that. So I just got to go up one, two, and we'll do three. So so that's one, two, and then by three. So we're gonna do them all like that. Try to make them all the exact same. All right, try to give them like no room as well. You don't need prisoners. Don't need room. Yeah, I'm not like I'm a little bit duck mode right now. I'm like, oh my god, I got so much. That's the thing. This game is very overwhelming like if you're a newcomer to this game it's very overwhelming and you'd be like oh my god oh my god I'm, I don't know what I'm doing I'm doing so much stuff right now but you'll pick it up like if you just do tutorial man they have such a good tutorial I know a lot of kids you guys are like we hate tutorials blah 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 but it's such a good tutorial on this game it has a little story to it I think it's I think it's really good actually And um, I think I do another cell here. I'm like being a little perfectionist, but I just wanna, I wanna have enough room to put these people when they get here. You know, these guys are scum. They must have holding cells. So they go. I think that's probably perfect holding cells. I mean, you could probably compress it more. You probably could, but that's the best I've done so far. I think this is the greatest game to record. Like, you guys are in for a treat right now. I really hope I'm not messing up anything. Like, I hope it's recording this. <laughs> so we're going to put down the doors. We have power now, which is great. We are getting along quite quickly. I probably shouldn't put the doors down first because they're going to need to put the toilets in. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, screw it. Okay, so here we go. Uh, for a place to actually be considered a cell, it needs to have toilet and a bed. So we have to put a toilet in every room and a bed in every room. And I try to put them just in the same area, no matter where I go. So now that they'll, they'll be doing this, we need to put the power and water and all that great stuff. Um, they still need to put down the pieces for the power. Or actually, what happened is the, it was too much. I'm pretty sure that's what it was. Like, the power is on, but you need to make these little power station grids so you actually have enough power. You can tell if you just go to switch on, and you can see how it's too high right there. It's way too high, so it's going to turn off. Forgot about that. You know, like I said, you know, you'd be forgetting stuff. You'd be playing this for a long time. You'd be. So I'm going to add a small pipe just connecting these particular, particular toilets. And then we're gonna take a large pipe and extend it down to connect to that. That'll get all this running. This will get the power turned back on. They put those up. That will all be okay. Now it's time to actually mark these rooms as cells. As you see, it says you require bed and toilet, all that great stuff. But you know, you can mark them before having the stuff in there, and it'll still mark them as what they are. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cells. 
Eight people arriving, 14 hours. We're doing great, but we need to do better. We're gonna make this the holding cell for when they arrive. We have somewhere to put them. We need a toilet and bench. So we're going to go to utilities and we're going to do a small pipe just at the very bottom so we can add some toilets. And um, I don't know if I'm being like too tutorial for you guys or not. You know, I'm just trying to have fun and play this game and kind of show it off. But there's just so much I have to do. I can't really sit back and talk too much. You know what I mean? I kind of got to play it. So much to do in this game.